Are you unhappy at work? If so, why? Have you ever really asked yourself that question? And if you have, are you always pointing the, your finger at some other person or situation or circumstance that is the reason for your own unhappiness? Because if you are, then sadly that's kind of a disempowered way of thinking and it's going to lead you to more unhappiness. If instead we can change our thinking to feeling about what can we do differently? What can you do differently about the situation? What is in your power to change? Then suddenly the whole world opens up possibilities of the ways you can think differently, the ways you can take charge of your own life, and what you can do to move forward here. Now, I find that doing a little bit of introspection is often helpful because sometimes we are just not in a situation where we can really thrive. And so to contrast with this feeling of being unhappy, I'd like you to spend a little bit of time to consider back to times in your life, in your career, that you have been quite happy. What is it that you were doing? What were the elements of those times in your work and in your life that you really, truly loved? Where you found joy, where you found satisfaction in what you were able to do. And think about what's the difference now? Some of it may be the circumstances. and You can find ways to take charge and find ways to add some of those other things in. Some of those might be the way that you're actually believing about yourself and the people that you're working with and working for. And so it's an internal change that needs to happen. In some cases, you may need to get in a certain, get out of a certain situation if you're in a toxic situation. And that's okay. We can work through that too. But first we want to identify what's the real problem that's causing it. And what do you want life like to look like? Uh, in a more happy way. If we can do that, then we can move towards an opportunity rather than just moving away from a problem. So if you're unhappy, think about what steps you can take and then reach out for help. I'd love to see if I can help. Feel free to let me know and we can talk about it.